Have you ever been haunted by a book? Maybe a book you don't even like? Here's today's bookmark. Hi, my name is Paul Beatty. I'm the author of The Sellout. The book I want to talk about, I don't know if I could recommend it in good faith, but it's a book I can't stop thinking about. It's called The Nazi and the Barber by a guy named Edgar Hilsenrat. And it's a book that was banned in Germany. I think the book came out in the early 70s, and it was banned for like 20 years because it looks at the Holocaust from the point of view of a uh, guy who was a prison guard at a uh, concentration camp. I don't even know if I like the book, but I can't stop thinking about the book because of the crazy questions that it's asked, the way that it treats the evilness that people bring to bear in all kinds of ways, and the way we forgive them and don't forgive them. I don't know, I just it's a book that really just sits on your chest and it just won't get off my chest. So, I mean, it's an easy book to read and to say, oh, you know, there's no culpability for a crime like that. I think it's easy to read that. You know, I could see being German and reading that book and going, ah, oh, see, we're, we're not responsible. And it's, the book's not saying that at all. And the book's also not saying that the victims are responsible. But it's asking that question about culpability, about responsibility, about, about forgiveness. I don't want to talk about the book without, you know, giving it away, but like, where identity is useful, where it's not useful, how it meshes, how we see people. You know, it's just, it's just a bizarre, bizarre book. I'm not religious at all, but talking about the Holocaust, I mean, religion is obviously a part of that in some level. And it just talks about where true power lies. The book is The Nazi and the Barber by Edgar Hilsenrath. Paul Beatty won the National Book Critics Circle Award and the Booker Prize for his novel, The Sellout. I'm Anne Strainchamps. Bookmarks are brought to you by To the Best of Our Knowledge. And you can hear an interview with Paul Beatty at ttbook.org slash bookmarks.